What's up, y'all? My name is Kron, and here we are back with another episode of Tales of Bale Spotia. I must apologize for not having an, uh, anything up yesterday on Tuesday, and also on Sunday, I believe. I skipped a couple days where there were no uploads. Uh, it's because I got a little throat swelling, swelling, I don't know what it was, but um, <clears throat> I was coughing a lot and speech wasn't very good. So um, that's why I had uh, two Wi-Fi battles pre-recorded, um, which is why uh, on Monday there was a battle and tomorrow there's going to be a battle, but those were pre-recorded and I'm recording this and uploading it tomorrow and then um, that's 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 the extent of my recordings. So, um, if recording is going a little slow, that's because I'm not ahead of schedule anymore. I'm always I always like to be ahead of schedule. Anyways, we are fighting Rene um, from Nihon uh, with no no thing. He's bringing a Shuckle Agron. Oh jeez, Shuckle Agron combo with Heracross, Manectric, Greninja, and Nido King. We're bringing Mega Sceptile and Mega Salamence. Screw you and <laughs> screw your Smogon. Also, Focus Ash Blaziken, no speed boost, but agility. Because screw your Smogon. And we have Choice Scarf, Explode, Light Orb, Starmie, and Arcanine. Uh, Rocky Helmet. So, um, I kind of want to bring the Salamence. But that Shuckle scares me. So I think I'm going to start with the Starmie. Um, because super effective damage at the very least. I don't have any... Oh, I can start with Arcanine and Will-O-Wisp. Um, actually, I think he's gonna want to start with the, um, the Greninja. If he starts with the Greninja, then I'm gonna want to start with Exploud. Uh, I'm gonna bring the Starmie, the Exploud, and the Salamence. How's that for a idea of what to do? Uh, I might have wanted to bring the Arcanine for the Heracross, because Arcanine would be able to resist and the Intimidate would be nice. But, uh, oh well. Hopefully we don't get completely swept and destroyed by Rene. But, um, he's gonna send out Shuckle. <coughs> See, the cough is kind of still there. Sobosobo, I think is what it says. Uh, we're just gonna go for Surf. Because, uh, damage, super effective at least. It's gonna do... Oh, that's a good chunk of damage, wow. Um, I know it's low HP, but... Uh, there's a citrus berry. Um, it's not gonna restore too much unless Surf will kill. And there's the stealth rocks, uh, which will uh, sting for Salamence, but really uh, no one else. Uh, I think that should be fine. Uh, Shuckle's gonna go down. Boom! There goes the there goes everything that it loved and learned from its life and death. Not sure what that was about, but that thing's dead. Now he's going to send out his Agron, which I will also use Surf on because very low special defense. Even as a Mega Agron, it's still pretty bad special defense. I also have the x in the back who has uh, the fantastic, wonderful, stupendous uh, Overheat, which will one-shot this thing. Without a doubt, there's the Thunder Wave. Honestly, I'm just gonna keep staying in. There's really no point in not staying in. If he goes with a Roar, then that's that's how it is. Um, Starmie's gonna get swapped out. Salamence or x is gonna go in. And either way, I don't mind at all. Um, he might want to go for the Stone Edge with if Salamence comes in. But I hope for the best that Starmie can still outspeed a freaking Mega Aggron paralyzed. Come on now. Azel! Couldn't out- wait, no, that's spoilers, that's spoilers, haha, -ha. I didn't upload that yet. I got- I- I caught myself, no worries, no worries. <gasps> no worries! Rene! Is that even the Ne character? If you know Katakana, then you're probably laughing at me because that's not the Ne character. I mean, nah, I know- I know it's an N. Nah, me. I suck with Katakana. Anyways, I am slower now. Which really is disappointing because it's a freaking Mega Agron, even when you're paralyzed. That is a critical hit! Boom! Shabba laba laba laba, shabba laba laba laba. 
Anyway, uh, Starmie, Starmie is really, really dishing to me the MVP of this uh, situation. And uh, he's probably just going to go for the Dark Pulse. Let's just keep going for Surf. Oh, uh, he's going to substitute. Okay, Surf isn't going to kill that substitute. Really now? Really? Really now? Oh my goodness, that really stinks. He's going to be able to get a Dark Pulse off. It's not... It's not what it's called. It's not uh, protein. Which is really interesting. Rather intriguing, if you must ask me. Um, but the substitute is really no problem. Because, like... Boom Burst, man. Like... Boom Burst. Rah, he's probably gonna be like, What the hell? Why did you go to my substitute? And it's like, Boom Burst, man. Boom Burst. Bitch! And there's a first win for a while, actually. I haven't done Battle Splat in a long while. So it's nice. Nice to actually get some kind of victory in my life. Because so far, life has not been very victorious. And that makes my life sound super sad. I'm sorry. Try I am having a fantastic life. Life is great. The sun's out, but it's not, and it's raining. This is great right here. This side of the box. Wow. You are so magnificent. Anyways... Azumarill, Alakazam, Gengar, Talonflame. So Arcanine's coming. Ferrothorn and Garchomp. So I think Arcanine and Exploud are coming again. <coughs> um, I'm gonna need something for that Ferrothorn. I don't have any special fire attacks, but uh, I do have Arcanine with Flare Blitz. But I'd really rather not use my defensive wall and take all that recoil that I'm gonna have to take. Um... I think I'm going to start with Blaziken. Um, if he starts with Azumarill, then that really sucks. I'm going to start with Blaziken. Bring the Exploud and the Arcanine. Um, yes. Uh, I think the only thing I need to fear is the Alakazam with starting with Blaziken. Um, actually, no. I need to fear the Azumarill. I definitely fear the Azumarill. Uh, the Azumarill... Well, I think he's gonna look at my Blaziken and go, That is a Mega Blaziken. He's probably gonna go for Protect. At the very least, he's gonna go for a Speed Boost. So maybe he won't go straight up for the Waterfall. Um, never mind! Talonflame is number one! So that means I'm going straight for the Stone Edge. Fuck yo shit! Not dealing with this shit! Brave Bird! Don't give a damn. I don't give a damn. Focus Sash, bitch. What's Mega Blazer King? It's a Focus Sash, bitch. Stone Edge is one shot in your ass. Fuck you, little cunt ho. I don't know why I'm talking like this, but fuck that Talon Flame. Fuck it right in the ass, bitch. And Azumarill comes out. So there's the Aqua Jet. Gonna destroy my face and my family and everything I hold dear in my life. Um, is there really a point in saving this Blaziken? Um, probably not. I'm just gonna go with the Stone Edge in case he wants to do something stupid. But uh, I think my best bet is to switch into Exploud and go for some Choice Scarfed... Um, choice Scarfed... Uh, Boomers, or I could go to Arcanine and uh, Will O Wisp. Um, Cause I don't think a waterfall will hurt me too bad after an Intimidate, uh, and then after Will O Wisp, it's definitely not gonna hurt that much. Um, I think that's what I'm gonna go for. After an Intimidate, I think he's gonna want to switch out anyways, and I don't believe there's another Fire type on his team. Um, let's see. Alakazam, Azumarill, Gengar, Talonflame. I don't remember. I'm gonna go for the Will O Wisp and hope for the absolute best. It connects this waterfall into a jack shit! 
Uh, he's basically like got minus three. Belly drum. That's still not too terrible. Um, he doesn't even. He has the. Oh, there. The citrus is gonna go off now. Never mind. Uh, because of the burn. But because also because of the burn, he's not at max attack. He's at um, rather rather sad attack actually. I'm just gonna go for the E speed because I outspeed. Um, I could have morning sun on his aqua jet, but I didn't really see a point. Wow, that does absolutely nothing. Um, there's the aqua jet, and that's still gonna do massive damage. But burn and E speed is gonna take it out, which makes me really happy. Um, so. I guess like plus three, I mean that's still gonna that's still gonna do a lot of damage. Um, he's gonna withdraw into the Ferrothorn, and that makes me really sad. Never mind, Gengar, Gengar. Okay, Gengar. Um, I'm fine with that. I'm absolutely fine with that um, because Boom Burst is one shining this thing um, without a doubt because Scrappy and. Um, Aqua Jet isn't gonna one shot me, uh, and that's that's for sure. Uh, because get Mega Gengar isn't isn't that bulky. Mega Gengar isn't that bulky. I'm pretty sure Choice Scarfed Explode is going to outspeed. I am timid. I max speed, 100% max speed. Choice Scarfed. I do have Scrappy. Please tell me I'm not misremembering things. Scrappy, there it is. I can go over the Boom Burst, and that should one shot. And I outspeed. Please, if you don't one shot, I'm gonna kill you. Oh my god, are you kidding me? Oh my god, and that puts me into Aqua Jet range. Are you freaking kidding me? That makes me all sorts of sad. At least he didn't go for the Destiny Bond. He didn't go for the Destiny Bond, which is cool. Oh my god. Ah! And that, oh, that's gonna, Aqua Jet's gonna kill. Unless the burn, uh, you know. He's burned! He's burned! 7 HP! 7 HP! Oh, yes! 7 HP! The burn to glitch! Oh, yes! This is probably why my throat messed up in the first place. But I don't give a damn! Oh my god, that's so beautiful! That's so beautiful! That's so beautiful! I am so glad I decided not to record while my throat was all fucked up. Because when I did that, wow, I was still semi-sick. Life would not be in any way, shape, or form good. So, um, Taka... Takaaki? Takaaki is fighting uh, with Dragonite Talonflame. So, Arcanine's coming again, especially since I see that Scizor, um, and that Sylveon. Sylveon, if it's a physical Sylveon, Arcanine can take it very like, easily, but it also resists the Hyper Voice, which is nice. Um, Sceptile can hit the Hippowdon. Um, but really nothing else. I want to bring the Focus Dash Blaziken again also for that Talonflame, because that was pretty clutch. That was pretty clutch. Um, Sceptile also is just fast. I like that. But I could just bring the x but the x gets... Dragon Knight's not going to die in one hit to it. Uh, I could bring the Salamence. Uh... I have not, I didn't, I want to make it evolve in this battle. I'm bringing the Blaziken, I'm bringing the Arcanine, especially since there's no, like, I mean, Hippowdon. I think that means I have to bring Salmon. Because I feel that Earthquake, man, I fear it. Uh, but Sceptile is super effective. Uh, but Hippowdon is normally especially defensive. Uh... I feel like you're going to want to start with that Talonflame, either that or the Dragonite. I'm going to start with Arcanine either way. Get that Intimidate up. It's going to be nice. I can eat speed things. Um, Takaki doesn't have a high rating, but still, uh, I don't think my team is well fit for it. Uh, I could have brought the Starmie. 
I, I, it's done! It's done, let's see how this plays out. He's gonna not start with, he's gonna start with the Hippowdon. So I'm gonna be intimidated off on the Hippowdon, uh, which is something. Uh, but it sucks because I didn't bring the Salamence to take an Earthquake. And I really would rather not me take an Earthquake right now. But I also would rather not switch into Salamence. I mean, Septon. Because him taking an Earthquake would also not be very, uh, good. Uh, I could just go for Will-O-Wisp and then Morning Sun. Uh, I think that's what I'm gonna have to do. Uh, after this burn, I don't think an Earthquake will do- No, he's gonna Rock Tomb! That's not doing too much to me, but it is lowering my speed, which is very interesting. It's very interesting. I do have the Rocky Helmet, I'm gonna get buffeted by the Sandstorm, he's gonna take burn damage. Um, I feel like he's just wanna- just gonna wanna out- uh, switch out. I feel like, I feel like ground resists fire, but rock doesn't. Ah, this infuriates me. I'm gonna go with a flare blitz, just because uh, with stab it'd be 90 if it's resisted. Uh, it's not resisted. It's not resisted. Boom! Eat that. Uh, he's gonna go for the rock tomb again. I'm gonna go for the morning sun uh, this turn. Do I need to? Hmm. I think so. I think this is a physically defensive uh, Hippowdon, so um, it's Citrus too. It's Citrus. Um, you know what? I think going for one more Flare Blitz won't be the end of the world um, because I there's like barely any recoil. He Rock Tomb barely does anything. Um, so yeah, this is gonna bring me a little. Oh, never mind. Oh, that sucks a lot. Bring out Septon. Oh, shit! That sucks a lot. Because now my Focus Sash is gone. Not gonna lie, that sucks a lot. I'm just gonna hit him with a high jump kick. Uh, kill this thing. It's gonna be dead gone. I really did not want to bring the Blaziken out. Uh, until the sandstream was gone and or the talent flame was in and I just wanted needed to fodder something But now I think the talent flame, if he has talent flame, then he's just gonna wreck me. That is the cut That is a dragon knight. That is a dragon knight um, And that's gonna outspeed me without a he sees that I don't have the speed boost um, I mean, I'm just gonna break the scale um with a stone edge, that's gonna break the scale. I do have speed, uh, so this isn't a Jolly Dragonite. That's gonna, he's gonna Dragon Dance up. He's gonna Dragon Dance up. Um, so he's gonna outspeed me this turn. But if he goes for the Roost, I'm going for the High Jump Kick. Um, he just does go for the Earthquake, but that means no, my Sceptile's not outspeeding, is it? Mm. Mm, 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 mm. Oh my goodness, if I had... I could go into Arcanine and go for the Intimidate? Um... Intimidate, and then hope an Earthquake doesn't kill? Or I could switch out a Sceptile on the upcoming Earthquake. And then, at the very least, I'm gonna get two Intimidates off. <sniffs> oh boy. That's what I did, by the way. I, I switched down to Sceptile on the upcoming Earthquake. Um, and then I'm basically, I'm basically foddering off the Sceptile. Because I'm not outspeeding it. it. Doesn't do too much, but a Dragon attack is definitely killing me. Oh, I do run Protect! I do run Protect, interesting. Okay, so I'm gonna go for the Protect. If he, if he predicts it, then shoot. But, um... Wow, if I knew I ran Protect, oh my goodness. I thought I had, like, double Grass Stab or something. There's the Outrage. Um, but I'm pretty sure that's one-shotting me. 
uh, because he outspeeds. He doesn't outspeed with one dragon, with, with one dragon dance. Can this one shot? It does! Septile! OP! Boom! Ground down goes the Dragonite! Who needs dynamite when you have a Dragonite that goes down? And the last move on a Scizor, that makes me a little more uncomfortable, but uh, at the same time, I think I got it because I do have the Intimidate, I do have the Will-O-Wisp, and I do have the Flare Blitz. And a Bullet Punch ain't killing me for anything, unless this thing has Earthquake as well. Um, Arcanine's got this in the bag. Arcanine's got this in the bag. He goes for a Swords Dance. Unsure why. Because I, he knows I have the Arcanine in the back. He can't kill me with a Bullet Punch. He can kill my Sceptile with a Bullet Punch. But he can't kill my um, Arcanine with a Bullet Punch. Especially after Intimidate, he's going to be at only plus one. He's going to only be at plus one. There's no point going for um, a Morning Sun now. If he doesn't go for the Bullet Punch here, or outspeed me in general, um, yeah, I'm just going to go for the Kill Shot. Can he, can he kill me with a bullet punch at plus one? Resisted? Hell no! Hell no! Hell no, mate! Hell no! And that is a flare blitz, and that is three wins! Are you fucking kidding me? Three win- One win! And two win! And the third win! What? After being away from Tales of Battle Smotion for a while, we are here with three wins. I want to thank the Academy, and I want to thank Arcanine, and I want to thank Blaziken, and I want to thank Sceptile, and I want to thank Sarmie for that first game, and I want to thank Explode for the second game, and Salamance really didn't do shit, so bringing an Uber doesn't fucking matter, you smoke on hose. So, um... Yeah, thank you so much for watching, and if you enjoyed, leave a comment below telling me what you enjoyed, and also if you hate this voice, comment below, and if you feel free to leave a tip in the tip jar with the Octothorpe tip jar, because tips can always help us become better battlers. So, until next time, Penguin Nation, out! Ugh.